We need to have fire drills so the students get practice on how to evacuate the building in the event of a real emergency as a fire drill or a tornado drill, and it gives them good practices to where they need to go and how to get out in an orderly fashion. And walk Every month we're required to have a fire drill, and so we plan at least one a month, and then of course there are um, other fire drills that are unplanned, you know, someone pulling a, an alarm or when people are here working on the um, alarm system that go off where we do evacuate as well, and the unplanned ones are just as good as the ones that we plan. And it looks like on the back side that those lights aren't flashing or anything. Yeah, I'm looking at that now. I'm going to pop in myself. Didn't, Mr. L, it didn't go off in the new building. Didn't hear anything, did you? Nope. Can someone in the front office make the announcement that we need to uh, um, evacuate for the fire drill? Well, because this is our new building, obviously there are some um, flaws and some things are still working out and they've been working on that as, long, as well as the um, portables because of the damage from Wilma. And we did have a problem where no one in the new building heard the um, fire drill go off. So it was a good thing that it was a planned event and that we could use this as an opportunity to have somebody come out and complete the work order to get that functioning again. Because if there is a, a true emergency, the students and the adults in the building need to hear that they need to evacuate. I just wanted to say that I know that the students and uh, staff all practice really hard and dedicate a lot of um, time and patience with the fire drills and all the evacuation drills because they realize how important it is and their hard work is noted and the students really do a nice job of um, maintaining control and waiting, you know, in an orderly fashion. All right, thank you. Please. Good morning. Please excuse the interruption. I want to thank everyone for their cooperation during the fire drill. I also want everyone to remember that we had to make some quick adjustments and that in any emergency we would need to use problem solving and initiative to walk around something that might be in our way or to find a different place. The goal of any evacuation is to move quickly and safely. It's not just to go to one assigned area, it would be to go to a safe place the fastest way you can. So let's keep that in mind and thank you for your cooperation.